Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Oblivion with myself, Poetic Heretic, and the Fool, as you see him here. So when we last left off, let us see. We have acquired the refined frost salts from Julien. Now make our way to Frostfire Glade. Yes, we've just gotten those frost salts from Julien that we need for this epic quest, Tears of the Savior. And we just slept and are now ready to be off to this place. So I'm going to do that as soon as I give my equipment a check. Elven bow needs repaired, I see. Um, okay, we do have one magical item that needs repaired by a proper armorer, so... We will make these preparations prior to leaving and then and then we will be off on this adventure to find the tears. Garadin's tears. So here we go. Greetings. All right, let's just head right on over. Shit, it's only 6.23 a.m. Hmm. These places aren't even going to be open yet if we wait that we don't get an early start. How bad is our armor? 90, it's not really that damaged. Hmm. You know what? Screw it. We're just gonna we're just gonna leave. Um, I don't know if I want to go that way. Let's. This leads to the like aristocratic district, doesn't it? If I'm mistaken. No, City Isle. Let me see what's out here exactly. Maybe that's the aristocratic district down there. Yeah, I think. Um, hmm. Well, where is this place ultimately? That's my real inquiry. That's where it is? Huh, interesting. Hmm. Okay, well, that works. Um, we can simply make our way up along here and onto the road and then make our way over to Frostfire Glade. Speaking of frost and fire, one moment. I have to turn my heater down. It always gets um, warm in here. I tend to get more warm when I record for whatever reason. Also need to keep my eye on the time so we have a good episode length and uh here we go all right so can we just kind of jump out of here perfect this is the fool he does not care about always staying on the road and everything else he is spontaneous and adventurous he goes where he wants to go and he goes there how he wants to go there there's a wolf I wonder if uh, we should get like some more powerful destruction spells sometime soon. I'm not going to do it now, but weren't we already considering that or something? A bit hard to recall. Hmm. 
know why I'm looking through these spells right now. <sighs> Give me now our, what is it? Shock spell. Only costs 36 and does shock damage 26 points for one second on target. I mean, does take out a mud crab in one hit, but it's just a mud crab. I don't know. We're not going to do that right now, though, so it doesn't really matter. Let's proceed this way. Across the water. Drinking green tea yet again. Oh, how dare you dodge my freaking attack. <sighs> yes, we are heading out bright and early for this Frostfire Glade. So we better start saving quite frequently. Um, there we go. Again, I save frequently because you never know with Oblivion. Yeah, I should use my zombies. Yeah, there. Attack them for a change. Zombies, join me for battle. Oh shit, we have a Minotaur. Didn't quite work. Yes. Come on. Come on, don't bullshit me. Hell, why can't I get him? Get back here. Where is the Tor? There you are, weakly. Seeks. What? That is such bullshit. I fired so many fucking arrows at him to sneak attack him, and then he fucking sees me. Jesus fucking Christ, you asshole. <sighs> you ruined my efforts. Effort ruiner. Yeah, hit him, zombies. Hit him. Make him pay for what he has done. <sighs> also probably use some more, uh, or some better conjuration spells or whatever. Um, alright, whatever. I want your horn. You can keep your horn. Let's save again. Yeah, we gotta get the full some even better spells at some point. Although, as I seem to keep forgetting, we don't have the gold for that yet. He got 3,951 gold. We need more gold. That's what we need. Oh, Bruma is this way. How nice. Jeez, I really need to play like a thief character or something sometime for a let's play. In this game, that, of course, I'm speaking of like a thief character, an assassin character, a vampire character. There's so many interesting possibilities. A necromancer character. What was that? Like, dude, think of the freaking possibilities. But we'll get there. 
We'll get there. Another ominous option is I could, um, if I really wanted to, I could try to go throughout the entire Tarot Major Arcana. So, um, once we conclude with the Fool, we would have 21 more cards to go through. 21 specific kinds of characters. Human consciousness archetypes. A hero's journey would unfold. I can run faster than this deer. Okay, who is it this time? The hell? Let's see. So a little weird in this lighting. I don't know. This enemy does. No. Wait. You can block with a bell. That's cool. Oh shit. Why are you forfeiting your bowman ways? Yeah, put that in your pipe and smoke it. Iron arrows, silver arrows. again you never know what this game might do to us mm. imperial city oh hell no one of these things mountain lion <laughs> Okay, don't you dare fucking dodge my goddamn attacks. Oh, now I'm fucking pissed. Well, if I die, then I die. Oh, insane. Must be some dynamic difficulty adjustment kicking in there. I see, that's fucking bullshit anyway, because that fucking piece of shit kept dodging my goddamn attacks. Even though they were, like, right on it. <sighs> Maybe I can sneak attack it. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. What the hell? Like stuck or something. Get it, zombies. Oh, nice. They're taking it out. What the? <laughs> wow. Amazing. Where is it? There it is. Mm, lion pelt. We don't need that for something, do we? Some quest. Oh yeah, that's right. Never mind. The fool is not one to. Uh, Consort with Daedra. I'm thinking of a uh, Daedra Shrine quest. I'm not even sure which one. Or one of them. So we've kind of 
gone past that area. So we need to just like walk over this way to get to it or what? What do we do here? Deer, give the wolf. gonna knock you over it, bitch. <laughs> How about that? A little hard to climb this hill, isn't it there, Minotaur? It's a little, a little tricky, isn't it? in this by now. I don't want to freaking utilize a potion or whatever. I don't want to. Okay. Okay. What the hell's that? A dwarven warhammer. Oh, I found Frostfire Glade. Must have belonged to the um, Minotaur. Here we are. Frostfire Cave. This is it. Taste it out. Tastes just like this cave. Oh shit. Die. We need some light. So we can see the dark. I realize it's not light, it's night night, of course. Um I know the fool's not a sneaky character, but uh he is now. He's he's grown a tiny bit cautious having been in this world for a bit now. Like, oh shit, I better sneak around. He still kinda does so like a maniac. Because that's what he is. Go investigate it. Investigating. Fuck. Attack these things. They keep doing this. Okay, that's it. I swear to God. Okay, fine. Kill me. I'm not. I'm not gonna put up with that shit. Just fucking kill me. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to validate that with a response. I'm not going to dignify that with a response. You 
mansion, mountain lion. Mountain lion in my basement? Go get it. I bet it's that quill weave next door. This cave sounds like a sewer. You can just hear that water and dripping, that dripping liquid. Guess what, bitch? Went right through it. There you go. There you are, weakling. Conjuration skill increased. Because I'm the boss. There, dodge that, bitch. Yeah, get him, zombie. <sighs> Shit. Anything else go over here? I've arrived at the entrance to Frostfire Glade. Like the book describes, the refined frost salts are in my hand. All I must do is open the seal by touching it. Okay, we'll wait just a minute. Let's explore these bits while my night eye expires. So we can see things properly. Actually, I guess we can just dispel Minor dispel. Oh. A fool cautiously and slowly approaches a mysterious icy door of frost and fire. I've entered Frostfire Glade. The entire area seems filled with a swirling, freezing mist. The extreme cold in this place is unbearable without magical protection. The glade is true to its namesake. The frost burns as if it was fire. I should now carefully begin searching it for Garadin's tears. Yes, okay. Um, probably save here just in case. Um, All right, so I don't know if this will help, like, protect me from the frost or not. Um, wait, what is that? You know what? Enough of the sneaking. Oh shit! Maybe we will sneak. Shit. Oh, fuck. Uh, go get him, zombies. Cold won't kill you. You're already dead. Shall electrify the frost atronach. How do you like that? Oh, shit. Freeze me. There we go. Assaults. 
Thank you very much. Uh, Frostfire Astronaut Glade Warden. Mm. My Glade Warden. Any more of those, I wonder. I'm saving again, I don't trust this shit. change because there's an enemy? What? There is an enemy. I do not detect it. Alright, whatever. Um... There's a tear. I found one of Garadin's tears. I should continue searching as there may be more. fingertips, his toes feel distorted as if they are going to break apart. But he finds another tear and he knows he must keep going. I don't want to guarantee you. Yeah, we already read that. This can take a while, dear viewers, so at any point you want to fast forward, feel free. Because even though I as a player have done this quest before, oh shit, you can literally see them in there. Even though I've done this quest before, um, that doesn't mean I just know where the tears are. Just remember that they're being kind of scattered about. Does this protect me at all? Probably not. Maybe it doesn't. Oh shit. Rest and meditate on what you've learned. Well, I will. Oh, there's one for fuck's sakes. Found one. Should continue searching as there may be more. There's one. Maybe more. More and more and more. 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 Tear up 
here. Donde esta? They do blend in fairly well. It says there may be more, but what if that's all of them? I can't actually remember if it tells you when you find all of them. I feel like if I haven't found I haven't found them by now. I mean, could there really be more? I've come to this place so thoroughly. And so the fool searched and he searched. He searched and he searched. don't know this point because I've really like freaking come to this place. Anything up, Anything up here if this fucking ship cooperate already? Would there be any tears out here? Here's the tears. to know how many there are. And was Garadan just crying all over the place or what? I'm thinking like okay maybe outside of this like just outside of this place somewhere there's one but uh I haven't found anything yet. What the? Are you fucking serious? Wait, no, 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 no. I just saw one. I knew it right there. I found the fifth and final one of Garadin's tears. I can now return to Sidrasa and lay a win for my hard earned reward and perhaps a warm fire. Yes, please, says the fool. A warm fire is what I want right now. I am freezing. I'm so cold. I can't feel my fingers or toes. And the tips of my ears feel like they're going to fall off. Time is in the game. 7.22 p.m. We have indeed spent all day long searching for the tears. Fortunate that it does tell you when you find the fifth and final one, although... Oh no, it's a little... A little unfair in a way when you think about it, because it's like, oh, well, you know, how, how would the fool actually know that that... It's the final one. 
Unless it said at some point that there are only five of them, but I don't know about that. I have no recollection of any such revelation. I have no recollection of this revelation. All right, so where are we located at? Here we are in the mountains at Frostfire Glade. Our best bet would probably be to reconvene in the Imperial City as per usual. From there, uh, well, at that location we can rest. And then in the morning, indeed, head back down. Down to Leowin, turning to Sadrasa. So, for now, we might as well just um, pretty much follow the quest marker and we'll end up more or less where we need to be. Oh, we also get to level up. We get to freaking level up. Yes. Yes. And, uh,. I don't think we're going to be buying any new spells just yet, even though I want to. No, fucking, fucking fuck. Improve your agility, or whatever the hell it is. As we get close to Skyrim, we hear Skyrim music. <sighs> Beautiful. As beautiful as this is, um, pretty sure that I'm pretty sure that when the day comes that I do another Oblivion Let's Play, um, I will indeed be utilizing a weather mod if possible, which most likely will be possible. Where am I? Okay, we're almost about to hit the road. Moss Rock Cavern. We've we've been here before, right? We dealt with this place, didn't we? Yeah, damn sure we did. I think we did with this character. Oh my god. It's hard to remember. Um what time is it? 32. Maybe we should instead stay at this inn. The bed lot. We could just sleep for free behind the inn. What the hell? The fool doesn't need to do that. He's not some poor beggar. Would you what can I do for you today? Um, should we sleep here? Guess we might as well. I mean, why wouldn't we? We just happen to come across it. It's time for us to sleep. Here we go. Yes, so I'd like to have a room, please. There's a bed of a sort. It ain't much, but it gets the job done. Ten gold a night if you're interested. Yes, I'll take it. It's upstairs, second door on the left. Don't say I didn't warn you. Yes, maybe I would be better off sleeping in bed behind the Thank inn. You for saving Hello my there. business. I won't forget. Yes, you're welcome. Who the devil are you? I'm trying to... All right. Yes, this one. Okay. The fool now lays down to rest for eight hours. Level 15. Now, you just stay at your peak as long as you can. There's no one stronger in Tamriel, but there's always someone younger, a new challenger. Oh, Oblivion, you and your insanely inaccurate uh, level assessments. <laughs> Dude, the fool at level 15 is just 
getting started, dear viewers. I mean, when this Let's Play is over, he's probably going to be at least level 30, I would think. I would hope. We'll see. Anyway. Uh, let's see, intelligence. <laughs> Willful power. Holy shit, I'm not really... These uh, differences are starting to become noticeable, aren't they? Um, <sighs> so I think intelligence is a clear winner. Uh, your total magicka and your ability to learn governs the skills of alchemy, conjuration, and mysticism. Yes, we want that. But what else do we want? I'll quickly regenerate magicka. How much fatigue you have? Destruction, alteration, restoration. See, again, I always hesitate to get willpower for the fool because the fool is not really very willful in my opinion. Um, he hasn't mastered his willpower yet at all. He's he's uh, he's new and fresh and spontaneous, you know. He's bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. He has not become yet the magician who is a master of his willpower and also very intelligent. Intelligence, I still... I still um, upgrade that a little more leniently because I feel like, well, I don't know, in the context of the game, like, that's kind of, well, it's hard to imagine a, a magical character, a character who uses magic who doesn't at least become intelligent over time. I guess maybe the same could be said about willpower, but I don't know. We have to draw the line somewhere. However... The Fool does have his strong suits with uh, things like personality and luck, which is why those are a bit higher than usual for such a character. But I also want to balance it somewhat with what is good gameplay-wise. So, um, let's see. Agility, of course. Security, Sneak, and Marksman. Oh yeah, I'd say he's quite agile, the way that he is. In his, uh, you know, sort of swift, nimble movements. Um, speed. Uh, could also see this being conducive to that. I know we've been over these things before, but while well, I'm going over them again. Uh, yeah, I feel like for roleplay purposes, we really do have to hold off on willpower still, even though it has a multiplier of three. You know, I, I draw the line there. So, but um, we will get agility, because that's fitting. We could get speed. Endurance is not really that applicable. I guess you could maybe say in a sense it is because ultimately the the fool representing the spirit incarnate has, I guess, the ultimate endurance because that spirit um, allegedly never dies. So maybe in a weird way you could make an argument for endurance, but we haven't been playing it that way, so we're not going to start now. Uh, let's see, personality or luck. Hmm. You know, I really think we should probably go with luck. <laughs> I really do. Again, for, for roleplay purposes. I mean, the fool and happy-go-lucky go together like I don't know what. So, yes. Luck. More luck. We are roleplaying. That's right. What, what are you doing in my bed? Jeez. Oh, you're that strange guy from downstairs. Oh. What's the fool been doing with this guy all night? Maybe I don't want to know. Um, let's, let's talk to him. Who are you? Hey, get up. Talk to me. What can I do for you? Oh, you're very close. Um, rumors. That's all I can ask you about. Watch yourself around goblins. Some of the nastier ones will toss spells at you. Thank you very much for that advice. <laughs> Goodbye. Yes, goodbye. Huh. 
How does the fool feel about this? Can we can we get it to show his face? A little hard to see, hang on. Do we have a torch? I think we have to have torches. No, oh, this wretched thing. Okay, here's a torch. Now let's see. He looks... That's hard for me to... Try this. He looks fairly happy from what I can see. <laughs> Up, there goes the torch. Can I... Uh, never mind. It doesn't matter. I was just curious. How's he look here? Just the same as always, I guess. Well, I don't know. The fool, the fool is happy, so... Read into that, whatever you want to read into that. Let's go. Alright, so, um... How is our equipment? Speaking of such things, um... Oh, I guess we, we weren't hit once by any of those enemies because it's still at 90, so, uh... I guess we'll just leave it like that then, yeah. See, we didn't need to repair it at all. We didn't even use it, really. Um, I feel like there's something else I was going to check, though. What the hell was it? I mean, so here we are. And we basically, yeah, we just need to head down to Leowin yet again. Make the long journey to Leowin uh, to get our payment from Sadrasa. Alright, so let me see how long we've been recording at this point all right we still have some time very good let's go all right guess we're taking this route oh 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 wait wait oh oh and i almost forgot the fool gets his level up bonus of uh Forget the ID of it as usual. But the gold nugget. I must now Google it live. <sighs> 49808, okay. 49808. There it is. Excellent. Now we could, I suppose, stop in the Arcane University um, and uh, and store it, but that's just, you know, whatever. Uh, probably probably create some new spells sometime now, but not right now. Anyway, yeah, there it is. Very good. Okay. Let's save just in case. My mouse up. Beautiful morning. This is a hold up. <sighs> Hand it over or die. You fucker. Distracting me from shit. No, take it from me if you can. Actually, that's the way this one prefers it. That's the way this one prefers it too. Here, fight my zombies. You don't want to fight my zombies, do you? Well, maybe you would like some acid. Take that bitch. And that as well. I'll get him, zombies. Get him, get him, get him. Yes. Get him. Ah. So satisfying. <laughs> ah. Take that. Um, I don't think I'm going to grab any of these things. Except for maybe this poison, I guess. We could sell that. 
Wait a minute, Elven Boots. I'm a reading of two. I don't think that's better than what I have, but let's take a look. No, it isn't. I see it already. Alright, um... Okay. Ethereal Shield, Armor Reading... So I don't even use a shield, do I? <laughs> I think I know this by now. Nope. Yeah, I don't think I want to start either. That doesn't really seem ideal. So anyway, we'll save that too. Her ear. Wow. Look at that sky. Let's get a proper camera on the fool. We can. There we go. Just look at that, dear viewers. Yes, I'm pretty sure next time I um, start a Let's Play with this game, I'll probably have uh, substantially more mods, just because, well, I'll inevitably discover more over time, um, whether through trying to, like, quote-unquote officially prepare for a new Let's Play, or um, just in my own, like, private time, like going to play more Oblivion and trying out different mods. The only thing that's frustrating is that Oblivion is so touchy with mods, it's like, oh god, you know. It's really hard to get things to be stable with this game unless you exercise the utmost precaution. And that can be hard to do, especially when you're already, like, playing it for a time with some. Interestingly enough, Mascar's Oblivion Overhaul was stable for quite a while with this character, but then eventually it was stable no more, and the fool entered a different universe. The fool entered a different unified verse. Can't take that, Spriggan. I knocked you over and hit you hard. Oh, take that. Yeah. I'm not so easy to hit now, am I? Spur again. Come and get me. Come on. Get her, zombies. Good. Actually, that, well, <laughs> theoretically, that's something that could happen um, at some point is, I don't want it to happen, but this game could theoretically destabilize um, to the point that it became unplayable, and uh, we'd have to basically start again, which obviously then I would start with a different character. Um... I don't want that to happen. I hope that doesn't happen, but it's always a theoretical possibility, like when playing with mods, particularly. Hang on. Gotta gather the ingredients. Why can't I get any of these? I thought my luck was supposed to be good. What kind of luck is that? I don't even need flax. Ugh. <sighs>
alchemical. This is that place that seemed to be destroyed in a strange and mysterious fire. Fucker. <sighs> God. Feels a bit like deja vu, doesn't it, dear viewers? Going back down to Leowin again. Is that a shrine of way? Shrine on the way of Julianos. Know the truth, observe the law, pray at my chapel altars to receive my blessings. us a scare. <sighs> but dodging my fucking attacks. <sighs> oh, what condition is my bow even in? Starting to need repair it. I guess we'll repair it now. Oh shit! We're actually down to four repair hammers. Wow! We'll have to replace those repair hammers soon, aren't we? As well. And our not like our armor skills gonna be up there anytime soon. Hey, look at that! We have four hundred four total magic right now with the fortification. That's wow! That's a lot. That is very much. But our armor skills only at thirty three. So, whatever. We're working on it. It'll be interesting to see with the economy mod that I have installed, making economy much more realistic and challenging. Um, it'll be interesting to see like how much gold the fool has by the time he is like level like twenty five or something. By the time he is what would be considered a high level for oblivion. You troll! Get out of the comments section. What time is it, by the way? 10, 19 a.m. Okay, where is it and what is it? Oh, another bear. Uh, I cannot bear this. I just took something. It was probably the goddamn pelt. Um. No, I don't really know what I took. If I took anything. 
Ugh, God. What's my carry weight right now? 150 out of 195. It's not too bad. I do wish I could. Uh, I'm not trying to summon a zombie and trying to heal myself. Wish I could carry more, is what I was about to say. Let's save here in case something wretched happens. Ten forty six eight. Collect the lavender. Be on the lookout for ingredients. at this time. The zombies, do you know where, where they are? Oh, sakes. There you are, weakling. Stop dodging my fucking attacks. Motherfucker. Ugh, I've had other crap, so I'll blast them over and over again. <sighs> Wait. What bow do I even freaking use again? Also a troll down there. I just saw it. What? Oh shit! Yeah, I guess I am out of magic, aren't I? Oh god! How did the hell did it survive that? There it is. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ! Chilling at the camp. Um, yeah, I don't know. For now, I kind of like this more vanilla oblivion feel. And then like the few mods I do have add just the right amount of um interesting new stuff. So yeah, I'm quite satisfied with the way this uh Play through the way this let's play is going. This side for Leowin. Dissatisfied indeed.
It's a quiet day now. Till an enemy appears. Except I don't see an enemy, so... I'm just gonna keep going. Because why not? There we go. Threat averted. Is it? What is it and where is it? Where is it located at? You again. The little imp. Imps in the forest. Imagine if imps were like real. Imagine if in real forests there were little imps and gnomes and goblins and berries and all of these things. Uh, there are those who say these legends must have come from somewhere. But those reasonable among us know better. Right. Certainly those things couldn't be real. that ruin. I like how it has a nice little bridge leading to it, but we don't have time for it right now. We must get back to uh, the bitch in Leowin. Um, so obsessed with his strange collections. They paid for the tears. I hope we get paid a lot, because I want more spells. More... Magic. Save just in case. Continue to make our way. To this location. Blackwood, our current vicinity. No one knows what lurks in the strange woods of Blackwood. Oh. Dreg. I'm going to stagger you. I can help it. Get it, zombies. Oh shit. Yeah. Don't go drag up something else. Uh, I'm 
just like that, it's dark and rainy and stormy. What the hell? What kind of shifting weather is this? Forty-three p.m. Three, four, three. Number of the tree of life. Uh oh. The enemy has been spotted. Why do they see me out oh, for fuck's actual sakes? You're gonna mess up my attack, bitch. Oh, fine, whatever. Charge! That's right. You know what? I think you would like some acid. I can just get close enough to you to make sure it hits. It's very easy to miss with the spell. I can just... Oh shit. Wait. What? Where'd you come from? That's right. You are going to be attacked by my minions. It's the last thing I ever do. That's right. Perfect. Is that that wretched bitch who was riding riding the horse? <sighs> Thought you were gonna get off of it and fight. Instead you left me to do everything. You distracted the enemy. And then you didn't even fight the enemy with me. <sighs> what kind of soldier are you? Now, after the storm, we are left simply with this spooky fog everywhere. Mysterious and haunting. As the fool ends ever closer to his destination of Leowen. Closer and closer through the fog, the bog, swamplands. To 
just changed because an enemy appeared. What lurks in the fog? Oh shit. Oh. This bitch again. Zombies, save me. Oh dear. Attack it. What the hell are you doing? Shit. Where are the guards? Here we are in Leowen Harbor. Get a better shot of it if we can. Beautiful. see a bit of light reflecting on the water to some degree. Oh, well, they are ready for a fight, aren't they? Prepare for battle, they say. Alright, here we go. Again, I don't trust this game as usual. We can make our way through the swamps and the slums of Leowen to the Guild of Mages. Marker, getting us right to it. Is it a little bit easier? Seven twenty-four p.m. Sajras, guildmate. You yes. look like you've seen some travel. Oh, I have. I have the tears. You found five of the tears? Fantastic! This turned out better than I expected. Perhaps a little bit of a bonus is in order. Sixteen hundred gold. Thank you very much, Sidrasa. Uh, what else do you have to say about these crystals? <laughs> um, this must be modded because nothing's happening. Oh well, hang on. Can we just like skip this? Ugh. Why did I have to use subtitles that I have to then turn on? Um. Well, Sandrasa, I am busy right now. Whatever you said, that's what I had to say to it. To it and about it. Um, any rumors? Some say Traven is misusing the power of the Archmage's position to further his personal agendas. Hmm. I bet he is. I bet he is. The tears look beautiful in my collection. A thousand thanks once again. A thousand, your 
welcomes. Yes. All right, so thank you so much to your viewers. Um, that'll be it for today. We have successfully completed the Garadin's Tears quest. And the fool now has... Okay, I'm not sure. I don't recall it being that much, but all right, I'll take it. We now have 7,151 gold. Holy shit. We can definitely buy a new spell or two in the near future if we so desire. Or we can save up even more and buy even more on this. I don't know. Yet we shall see. Regardless, yes, that is it, dear viewers. Thank you for joining me today. The Fool and I bid you farewell. Bye for now.